Good morning, everybody. It is Thursday, June 2nd, I think. Um, I I know you've joined me for the past, it seems like, several weeks, uh, watching me paint this guy. And it, I mean, it certainly turned out to be a um, challenging painting. Um, I've painted <clears throat> this grizzly bear's face and, of course, the body part that's exposed four times before I decided, yeah, I think, I think I've got it now. Um, and I recall telling you that always after I finish a painting or I think I'm finished with it, I put it away for a week or so. And I've had this painting, yeah, probably a day now. I finished it up yesterday. And the odd thing is, I'm thinking, oh my gosh, how did I miss that? I need to bring this ear up a bit. Sometimes you can't see the forest because of the trees. But, <laughs> and I thought the water was going to be a lot harder. Sometimes water just really presents a challenge. But I painted the background, I mean the water bed, in a sap green. And uh, I overlaid it with some brown in places. Because the water does get a bit murky. And then I used uh, white with a little... Uh, brown, light brown in it um, to make the the shimmering in the in the uh, water not quite as too much contrast there. But this this guy's gonna be stuck in the closet for a week or so and then I'll decide what else needs to be done. I may have to even bring up this area a little bit. Not quite sure. And I may have to highlight the nose a little more to kind of bring the nostrils and everything out. So thank you again for joining me. Um, I do have a couple of canvases blocked in, but uh, I'll share that with you next week. Thank you. Have a